this is something. I'm trying to do my hair so that I can go grocery shopping. I'm not exactly sure how this happened. I only have two cords sitting right here. I don't do my hair, hair and makeup in my bathroom because um, the lighting in here is just so much better. So why not? So I have never been one to like use a blow dryer until now. I mean, this isn't even actually a blow dryer, but, but it's an airbrush and I love it. I need to moisturize my face because my skin always gets dry after the shower because I'm not gonna take a cold shower. Sorry, not sorry. It's gonna be like, it's not even gonna be 60 degrees today. Always moisturize your neck. I think your hands and your neck are like the things that like age you the fastest. <laughs> we don't need that. I'm going to clip my hair. Just because this is the way that I find it easiest to do. And it's got three settings. It's got cool, low, and high and um, I don't like loud noises, so I always keep it on low and it does the job perfectly. Done with one side. It's like getting a blowout. What? What? <laughs> Just so I can show you like how quickly, where's my phone? It actually blow dries and like dries my hair and I literally like just got out of the shower so as you can see my hair is like still pretty wet um and it would take forever to air dry i'm going to i'm going to start my timer and we're going to see how long it takes and my bangs are done in like a swoop it took me three minutes to get my hair completely dry and as some might leave their hair styled like this, I mean, you could, I have obviously, but my hair just does weird things. But yeah, three minutes. I'm going to turn my straightener on, curl my hair, and we're gonna get on with our day. I've moved on to my makeup and I wanted to show you my favorite mascara the voluminous lash paradise by L'Oreal okay makeup's done hair's done yes I put it in a ponytail because I don't like the way it looks just straightly just down I haven't put any lip stuff on yet but I will eventually I also just got this duvet set for Christmas and it's so nice. It's coming off more like brighter than it really is. Scratch the idea of me going to do laundry now because it just in my head made sense and for literally no reason. So I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and then I'm gonna come back and do laundry so that I'm you know, not one of those people that like puts their laundry in and then like forget, forgets about it. Um, because I know it only takes like a half hour to 40 minutes and I'm definitely gonna be longer than that because it takes me like 15, 20 minutes just to get to Trader Joe's. So um, I'm just gonna do that when I get back and then I can clean and do things while I'm waiting for my laundry. Okay, here we go. I also just realized that I never did an OOTD, but my shirt is a hand-me-down. My purse is from Alex. She got it for me for my birthday. My laundry <laughs> my pants i got from kohl's and then the same little boots from target that i always wear but they're super comfortable and like perfect so okay now we can go you're cute i love you I also wanted to show you this really quickly, this little thing that I got. I It doesn't really work very well because my things go like 
this and it's really annoying because then like my phone weighs it down but anywho I have this magnet on the back of my phone case and I just stick it on here and like voila look at how, how look at how fun that is and yes I still have a Christmas background I really need to change that so this is fun my battery is gonna die I mean it's that like I don't know what percentage but it's like halfway gone so um we're gonna go to uh Trader Joe's. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna get. I've just been there a few times and I know that they have some really interesting things that I would like to try. Um, so we're just gonna go and see what they got and maybe get a few things to like spice up my food. <laughs> I'm at Trader Joe's. I was like this close to going home. I actually had turned around and went home because there was a large line of people outside. I didn't know that Trader Joe's was this popular. I mean, I know that it is, but however, I did not know that there were lines and it's continuing to get bigger. Oh my God. Okay, well, I'm back. It actually wasn't that bad. Um, they had a lot of really good stuff. I mean, it's not some, it's, I don't think it's a place that I could go and get everything that I like, but I'm really excited to show you what I got and I'm going to go home. It's like one o'clock now and then I'll do a little mini haul for you. Got my Trader Joe's haul all ready for you. Okay, so super excited. So I don't know if anyone watches Tara Michelle, but she always has gnocchi from trader joe's i mean she did when she lived in california anyways i decided to be like tara michelle and get gnocchi from trader joe's i also got one with the tomato and tomato sauce and mozzarella cheese got two types of gnocchi super excited um i got two potatoes i normally don't get potatoes but then i was like mm, like 69 cents for a potato Okay, so I got two potatoes and I can put like butter on them. I don't know how to cook potatoes, but we're gonna figure it out. Um, darn it, I was supposed to get something to go with these. Apparently I got sour cream spinach dip. Um, I love spinach dip and I was supposed to, I was supposed to go back and get like um, a bread or a bagel or something to go with this. However, I did not. Um, so I will figure something out for that um and then I got some chicken breasts I don't have chicken hi kitten hi and then I got some apple juice because I was like mm, I don't have really anything to drink other than like water right now and then I got I wanted something like pesto -y and I couldn't find any pesto gnocchi so I got this organic pesto tortellini cheese tortellini with basil pesto sauce so that's everything i got i mean i didn't want to get too much because i wanted to like see if i liked everything first but i think i did pretty good for like my first time at trader joe's so this is everything i got super excited to try this i really wish that i had gotten something for this but i think everything i think I think it'll be good. We can have some chicken and a potato and maybe some gnocchi on the side. We're gonna try to make this. Probably turn the stove on. I guess that might be good. It says two tablespoons of water. One, two, that doesn't seem right. 
some yogi and put it in, I guess. I guess that's just it. Like, it says stir gently until gnocchi and sauce melt together and warm through about seven minutes so i guess we'll just wait and see how this goes i guess this is what it looks like frozen i'm guessing this is like the sauce and then the noodles obviously so maybe maybe tomorrow um when i'm not spending the entire day cleaning and being busy we can make dinner a cook with me video? <gasps> what? Paige? Cooking? What? We might do that. I'm in love with this pan, by the way. This is the brand. It was like a $10 nonstick pan from Target. If you need a nonstick pan, literally no joke, go to Target and get this pan because it's amazing. So this is how it's looking. It smells so good. I'm kind of like unsure how to tell if it's like done. Yeah. I added a little bit of shredded cheese because I love cheese on everything. So I'm gonna sit down, have my dinner, watch some TV and enjoy the rest of my night because I've been doing like a lot all day today and I'm exhausted and starving. So thanks for uh, watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I'm trying to do a new style of filming, editing, trying to, you know, make it more, I guess, if that makes any sense. Like, make sure to subscribe and I will see you in my next video.